Let's watch the yo yo tricks. Hi, kids, and today I'm going to show you two tricks, two very easy tricks that you should know if you have one yo First, this one. First, this one. And then the elevator. For this one, you have to get it a very nice sleeve. Get it up and then lay down. You have to get it a very nice sleeve. Get it up and then lay it down. So first I'm gonna show you the first the easiest. So you have to so when you are holding your uh, yo-yo, don't hold it like like the, the string is not supposed to go from the bottom, it's supposed to go from the top. So the string is at the top of the area. So like this, you can make a muscle and then you just toss it down. And then you just flip it over and then come. Now I'm gonna show you how to do it faster. Failed. Next try. So I actually don't like to, like, I don't like to throw it like this. My way, I just like to hold it like this and then throw it so I get a way of powerful spin. And that's how you do it. So again, you have to throw it like, I mean, it's your choice. You can throw it like this or like this. I like to throw it like this, which is perfect. Okay, next, the elevator. Make it a little sleep off and then just pull it up. So, you have to make it sleep. Get it like this, and then I'm gonna show you without it spinning. So get it like this, then you should, it should basically be like a trapeze, but then it has to be steady and then you can, uh, pull the bottom up and then which is gonna cause it to move the yo yo up. It's like magic trick but with a yo yo. So kids I don't think this yo yo is good because I bought it from this doll store. It also doesn't have a bearing which is very bad. It doesn't sleep for long and it is plastic which is not that heavy. So in the next video, I'm gonna bring a very, very, very awesome heavy metal one with a bearing inside it. And let's uh, compare this dollar store yo-yo from the other metal heavy professional yo-yo. And bye-bye. Like this video, comment down below, and watch the next video. Click right here.